uh, belonging to this camp. There are about uh, there is a, an RO system uh, of capacity so and so and so there. Or in the hostel there are about 400 students say, staying and for these 400 students the RO unit designed is uh, uh, this is the design pressure, this is the uh, flow rate, this is the RO membrane and uh, this is the running cost. Pressure. This small thing also if you don't do it then uh, Will you do, how many of you will do next class? Only one, two, three. Do it. No, it's a type of process. We have only one pending topic and that is uh, the topic, uh, how to solve pipe networks using Hardy cross method. Uh, we will solve it. This is often given as a uh, full fluid percent. That is, you will get it as a 16 marks percent. And uh, it is full of calculator and the advantage of this problem is that we, there will not be anything like a mistake. Because each case you have to apply a correction to that and you have to find the half cross correction factor uh, till you get it as zero. So even if you do a small mistake, the correction will be rectified and ultimately you will get the correction as zero till that you have to do it. So even if you do a mistake, one or two small mistakes, they will be rectified and ultimately you will get the exact value. This is the beauty of this method hard -tickler. Before we do that, let us uh, uh, see some of the terminology, general things that me just tell. One is Pari uh, plus avaranam is pariyavaranam. Which sandhi it is? Which sandhi? Please write. Uh, may not be useful to you now, but in persons like, in aspects like uh, Mahakarodpati, things like that, such questions may fix you 50 lakhs or 1 crore also. Pari plus avaranam is equal to Pariya Avaranam. This is Yan Adesa Sandhi. Or simply Yan Adesa Sandhi. Yan Adesa Sandhi also is uh, Sanskrit. Yan Yana Adesa Sandhi, these are all uh, Sanskrit grammar also. Who developed Sanskrit grammar? Panini, please write it. It is a very good general knowledge question. P A N I N I, Panini. When he was doing, uh, uh, he was work, he, when he was developing grammar, treating it as an ignya. Ignya does not mean, uh, ignya means actually doing a work with utmost dedication and uh, devotion. That is called ignya. So his ignya was to develop Sanskrit grammar principles. One day when he was doing, he listened some sound. He felt that it is the language of God is always the rustling of the leaves, the chirping of the birds, the movement of waters. All this is the language of God. He knows that. He will not speak Telugu or Malayalam or Kannada or Hindi or a mixture of these languages. His language is different. Nature is God. Both are same. So the language of nature is the language of God. He felt like that. So he heard a sound called Yan, the first sound. He felt that it is from the Shiva's Bhamaruka. So he felt that it, it is, uh, God has given as a gift to him that uh, Panini take this as, the, as a uh, gift from my side. So he called it as Yan Adesa Sandhi, Yan Adesa Sandhi. Parikla Savaranam is Pariyavaru, Yan Adesa. When I joined my MTech Environmental Engineering, MIT Surat, when I came back, my mother asked me, uh, when structural engineering is so good, construction engineering is good, and uh, foundation engineering is good, everything is very good. People say that environmental engineering I never studied. I never, I do not know. What is environment? Why environmental engineering you took? I said I like it. 
what is environment then i explained all these things environment means surroundings that means it is paryavaranam because it is there in sanskrit in all indian languages you will find it as paryavaranam only hari prasarana it is anadeshandi shivashtha murka or all this then my mother asked that all is okay what is environment means what tanini told or what kalidas told or what valmiki told or what vasistha told or what vyasa told that is immaterial to me that is i am not coming so my whole world is you you are my whole world what you are what you think you are what your knowledge is how you have understood environment what is your definition of environment i am interested in that only i am not interested in what tani ni told so i know that my mother will ask this question so i was coming from sorat to bhimavaram it was navajivan express and uh, it, it 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 takes almost 30 hours and in this 30 hours journey i prepared the answer i know that my mother will ask what is environment how to such an answer but uh, she should remember and she should be proud of uh, being the mother of uh, this boy your answer should be like i know that and when you get the appreciation from your mother it is like you are the chakravarti of all the 224 countries of the world if there is a smile dancing on her lips with a confident smile if it, is, if it dances on her lips it is like you are the king you are the emperor of the world so when my mother asked uh, that all is okay what is environment what is environment means in your opinion what is environment then i answer as kondala bandala kundela maduna sancharinchu kukkalu nakkalu pillulu ballulu teelu taavelu kundelu kichralu paavuralu one tan man sancharita one tan man sancharita ushtra aja bhejanu bhujanga toranga vruka jambuka masya makara markata kitikarkata karakukkuta chataka chataka kapota sarasa drutra utruka matkuna mayura madhupa suka baka simha sardula rushava bhalluka bhairava dartha varjala tanava manadu devatadi jantuti santaha yameva paryavaranam ಓಗಿಗಳಾಶ್ರಿತ ಭೋಗವಾಲಸತ ನಿಚ್ಚಗರ್ಜನಾಶ್ಚರಿತ ಮತ ಮಾತಂಗ ಮಕರ ಭೀಕರ ಭಯಾನಕ ಭೀಪತ್ಸರಂಗ ಸ್ಥಳಂ ಇಯಮೇವ ಪರ್ಯಾವರಣ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಡೆಫಿನಿಷನ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಟು ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಐ ಟೋಲ್ ಆರ್ ದ ನೇಮ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಆನಿಮಲ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಮೈ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ್ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಯು your second language is sanskrit and you all got marks like 98 99 because you have studied for marks and you will be left only with marks but i have put interest as investment nobody has directed me to learn sanskrit or to make your own meaning i have made it i these are all with some rhythm in particular fashion when i tell this it was convenient for me to remember the names of the animals in a particular fashion i can tell the meanings of those animals ushtra <laughs> ushtra means i think camel aja aja means uh, aja means goat aja aja means goat ushtra aja venu venu means cow ushtra aja venu titi titi means pig markata markata means Markata means monkey. Makara means crocodile. Simha means lion. Sardola means Sardola. Sardola is tiger. Rama was described by his teacher as a tiger. Tiger is our national animal. It is the multifaceted animal. It is the second best animal in long jump. Ten meters it jumps. First best animal in the world is not human being. It is uh, kangaroo. 13 meter it jumps second best animal in high jump from 13 meter height also it can jump with somersaults also it can jump perfect landing 
Nothing happens to them. Amnastics, it is number one. It is almost like Nadia Kominesi. You know Nadia Kominesi? She is the only human being in this world who got 10.000 by 10.000 in Olympics. That is perfect landing. There is a movie also on her, Nadia Kominesi from Romania. So when she, after several summers also, when she lands, perfect landing like this. Nobody gets uh, more than certain value, but she got 10.000 by 10.000. And uh, when it comes to poor wall, it is almost like Sargi Bukti. You know who is Sargi Bukti? He broke his own world record about 10 times in the Olympics. 10 times in international games. He says that this is competition. Competition is excelling your friend. Competition is self-excellence. You have to excel yourself. So, tiger is an uh, animal. Uh, Vishwamitra, when he asked Rama to wake up, he says, Uthishtha Narasar Dola. Karta Vim You have a great divine thing to do. Your duty. So, Uthishtha. Please raise it is already 4 o'clock. You will wake up at 8 o'clock, it is a different. So, these are animals only in Sanskrit. Pushka, Asa, Dhenu, Bhujanga, Bhujanga, Toranga. Toranga is horse. Bhujanga, Toranga, Ushka, Asa, Dhenu, Bhujanga, Toranga, Masya, Makara, Markata, Kiki, Karkata, Kara, Kukkuta, Jataka, Chata. This is my horse. I feel very happy. Many people, they say that when they visit my house, uh, which is uh, in a, about one, one kilometer from the campus, it is in a remote area only, relatively. People, when they come and ask somebody, where is uh, Professor Murali Krishna's house? People say that you just take a right turn. Uh, you will find a uh, house full of trees and other things, very green type of thing. That is Ankisar's house. People, when they say like that, I feel very happy. And uh, on the left hand side you are finding, you are seeing a very big tree. Just besides this you are finding a tree, which is difficult to identify. It is actually Rudraksha. Very few places from the entire state of Andhra Pradesh you will find this plant uh, growing. Because it doesn't, it requires some special conditions. Rudraksha is a very, but you, you, you will find it here. And uh, okay, but all is okay, leave it. Uh, this is mainly the point I want to tell you guys. About three days before, suddenly there is some problem in the pipeline which supplies water to our locality. Water line is always laid below the, below the ground, not here. Below this it is laid. There is a leakage in that. So what happens when there is a leakage? Two hours or three hours water is supplied. Remaining time water is not supplied very much by During these three hours, water fo flows under tremendous pressure. So if there is a small leakage here, what happens? It, uh, it water will uh, come out with lot of force. And uh, it always uh, comes out into the ground where the ground is not good. For example, this is a bitumen road or a cement road. Suppose it is a very strong cement road. Then water will not flow. It will come out from another place somewhere. Here it will not. It will come out. So underground water has to come out to the surface. So if this is very strong. It will not come out here. It will come out uh, some place where it is weak. This ground here, it is slight, uh, not strong because of rain. It is uh, damaged here. Water could come, come out and uh, it is stagnant here. Similarly here also. Lot of stagnant water you are finding. Throughout the day you will find this water. Morning only it is supplied, water is supplied. So morning only water is water flows under pressure. So this situation happens. What happens after the three hours of pumping? After three hours, water pumping is stopped. Every water drop present in the pipeline is used by us. Remaining 21 hours of the day, what happens to the system? All this water, in this water, some pits will move. 
bachelors, cow dung will be there. Dogs, every nonsense will be there in this. Yes, sir. And all this contaminated water will go back into the pipeline under gravity. Because every drop of water is taken out from the pipeline, there is no pressure inside the pipe. So water always flows from high pressure to low pressure. Earlier it was flowing from the one meter below, pipe below one meter to the ground because inside there is a lot of pressure. One kg per centimeter square pressure is there. So it could come out to atmospheric pressure. Now from atmospheric pressure to the pipe where vacuum is prevailing water will get. So naturally the morning when water is some supply, what happens to that water? That water will first flush all the water, this dirty water remaining in the pipeline and that water is sent to the public, bin and all. Yes sir, no? And not that it, uh, it of this particular area only are affected. That water may be conveyed to any other place. Because it is a closed network always, the entire system may be affected. So, this is the main problem. That is why residual chlorine must be present in water. What happens if residual chlorine is present in water? Along with the residual chlorine from uh, uh, Kulai tank, where water treatment plant is there, to Rajeshwari Nagar, that is place, the distance is almost uh, 3.6 kilometers. One hour is how much? That means. So one meter per second, if water flows with one meter per second, to distance of 3600 meters, that is 3.6 kilometers, it takes one hour. So water, treated water with residual chlorine will come here to reach nearly, it will take nearly one hour to reach my place, from that place. So when this place, water here is contaminated, this uh, contamination also, it will be in a position to fight by there. So water is, that is a very good water supply system. Am I clear now? If you have residual chlorine present in water, in a future pipeline, if any contamination, it will fight against that bacteria and will kill it. So this is a very important system. And uh, Raja Srinagar is almost a terminus, let us, let us say in one particular community, it is almost a terminus. Terminus means, what do you mean by terminus? Terminus means the end point, very last. In Bombay, there is a place called Victor Viti, Victoria Terminus. It's a very, very famous place. Why it is called Victoria Terminus? It was the last point for uh, uh, several uh, roads and other things. It was an extent, uh, last locality of Bombay. But it is now in the middle of the city. Because city has further development. For example, JNDU Kakinari University was located in forest almost like first, all this from Bhanugudi, three kilometers away, it is all, it flows into the pipeline and uh, it leads to several health problems. It is not a good water supply system. So 24 by 7 supply is always uh, best recommended. In such, in such cases, even if there is a leakage, the river flow will not take place. <laughs> This is just, uh, no, I think I have already shown it. Which uh, locality, can you guess? My house. For me to get an answer. But you can close up, uh, can they say it in a close up? Can you imagine this is actually a vertical wall? This is a vertical wall. Inside, in several uh, inclined positions, something like lovers, a uh, lot of uh, placed here in small, small uh, uh, pots. And these are all trees growing in this. Is it good? Good landscaping? Okay. I'll be very happy if anybody is uh, lucky enough to tell the place, the exact place. One guess I will give and that is, okay, it is an airport. Which airport you will find this? Huh? 
How can you say Bangalore? Huh? Chitrakonda Great Bangalore. Ralakonda Hero Baba. Kajar Airport Lane Kunda. This is uh, Hyderabad International Airport. Punch a close up uh, can be seen. You are seeing here, it all is, you know, whatever I do, you have to link it to water supply. That is what I want to do. See, here you are seeing, uh, if you punch a pipe, this also. Okay. I should have brought another photograph of you. You are seeing uh, very keenly, if you observe here, you are finding a point, slight point. Here is another point. These are all actually water supply connected systems. Water, uh, they need water, no plantation, watering, you, you have to do it. So what they do with the help of small pipelines and which uh, water falls drop by drop, intermittently, every day, some a few hours, drop by drop water, come, water falls. You are seeing it very clearly here. The thread color. Uh, here, 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 here. Yeah. You remove it. That also is in black. <laughs> this one. So, like that, if you keenly observe inside, you will find so many uh, points which supply water through nozzles. And uh, even though this this is a pot, pot uh, at a height of almost 10 meters, to a height of 10 meters, the vertical wall, and you will find so many plants and flowers. Very beautiful. Next is. So creativity is very much essential. Civil engineering, creativity is very, very important. One dictionary meaning of the term engineering is creation. Creativity is the freedom given to commit mistakes. Next is. We have come to the last stages of this MOOC. What I want to tell you throughout, I personally feel that 7th class, 8th class and 9th class children who are the best target group if we want to bring a change in them. So, I always see it as a yajna. I always love to share my knowledge and tell beautiful things to children of 7th class, 8th class and 9th class. And uh, this service, you also can do it. You, can, you should visit some distant places and educate them about the, the saving of water, importance of plantation, how to reject the very fine plastic covers. They are dangerous to the animals because many animals they eat unknowingly, innocently and they may die also. So all these sort of things related to environment and also maybe of course water also, you can educate them. At this age, persons of your age group, when you go to villages and educate your children, the 7th, 8th, 9th class boys, you can bring a lot of change in the people. So this you can do as a, an assignment. Treat it as an assignment and uh, go to some college at least and try to educate. You can educate even first year BTEC students also about some of the beautiful things. Yesterday, I received one... Uh, WhatsApp message from one of you and I profusely thank the man. He is from uh, Aditya Engineering College. And uh, he says that, sir, please discuss, spend some time on this particular topic. And I complimented him also. What he says is, when a person, any engineering student, when he comes to finally have he develops a frustration, irritation, and perversion because he is helpless to do anything in life. Out of one lakh students, engineering students, one lakh engineering students who are completing their people, 90,000 students are not having any job. They are simply wasting their time preparing for complete examinations and in, from a class of about from a, if 1,000 students are appearing for great examination, preparing seriously and sincerely in the, with the word Hyderabad, morning 6 to night, 8 o'clock, they listen to classes sincerely, 
sincerity, but they are not getting even qualified also. And for all uh, government jobs, it is compulsory. It is compulsory. And uh, they are not able. We are not able to speak in English. Then why why all this is happening? And it needs a thorough change in the education system, or what is that? We do not know. But uh, you should see that some workshops are conducted, and some interested students from various colleges they sit together along with the faculty members and see that something is done. Your subject, we are feeling that it is very easy, but we are not able to understand anything, do anything. So we are in a state of frustration. Especially, this is coming only in final year because suddenly we are realizing that uh, uh, till then we are uh, spending time just now. Is it true? How many of you think? Okay. So this is uh, one such picture. Uh, I always prefer taking a photograph like this. With your own classmates and friends in your background, and your principal or headmaster on your side, and if you have a photograph like this, such that you have talked something, you have expressed your views boldly, and then you compliment them, give a small note as a gift, and then have a photograph like this. I'm telling you, it will inspire the students of this age like anything. So treat it as an assignment, and try to do this maybe. Uh, Some eighth class, seventh class, and uh, tell some important points related to environment. Can you do that? Oh, <laughs> this is another beautiful thing which I wanted to share. All this, uh, this is a latest picture only. Two, two days before I took the picture with my cell phone. This is uh, these the students. These are all girls from. Uh, Vyada Vidya Peet from Basara. You should know that it is from Telangana. We are beyond the limit. We are thought to be beyond the limit. We will be surprised. Veda means knowledge. People say that actually Veda is uh, the form of God. It is knowledge. It is God. It is knowledge. There is a general belief that. Vada should be recited only by men. There is a belief that Vada should be recited by a particular community only. But in Basara, there is in our own place there is a beautiful Vada institute where Vadas are recited by girls of all communities, all castes, and all religions also. There is a Christian girl in this, and uh, people of all castes, all castes, you will find in these girls, and they are all girls. There is a belief that only men should be there. So what I am telling you is, this country is great, and uh, when it comes to knowledge, there is nothing like uh, all this barrier is. Uh, I will be very happy today. Uh, recently, Women's Day was conducted, International Women's Day. Everybody was saying that you know, in Chennai, Singapore is there, in Maharashtra, women are permitted to go, men are not permitted. Only men, men can do it. Now there is a lot of uh, national level issues going on, but women also should be permitted. I now suddenly they are starting that uh, Ayappa is there in Sabari Malai, where women are not permitted. It means uh, girls, young, young girls and young women are not permitted. So there is a lot of issue going on. So uh, in this regard, you should appreciate that there are places like do a big hand to them. <laughs> Now recently we conducted uh, this sauda for which uh, a workshop was conducted uh, in uh, the University College of Engineering where. Two guests were there. About 800 students they came for participation. But out of these 800 students, when the person who planned and designed everything he did, majority work for the city of Amaravati, including the SME, including the chief minister's bungalow, including the high court, everything, location planning, everything is done by was planned by him. Uh, Then he came to present and explain how our is designed, the glory of civil engineering, etc. 
harmony of your purpose. Very few. Think about this, because we have, we have come, it is good. But 800 students from various engineering colleges have come. And when he started, there were only 20 students present in the seminar. And you are not showing any such type of persons. When such type of persons come, you should develop a rapport with them. What is the spelling of rapport? R-A-P-P-O-R-T. It is, spelling is R-A-P-P-O-R-T, rapport. But you should pronounce it as rapport only. Thus, Bipo. What is the spelling of Bipo? B-E-P-O-T. Bipo. You cannot say Bipo. It is Bipo. The bus is going, we say, hold on, hold on, hold on. What is the correct spelling? It is hold on. Whenever you start your running race, we say, Aneman. It is not Aneman. It is on your mark. So what I say is, when he came, he was saying that there are nearly about 600 posts are there for CRP. And uh, only 200 posts are recruited. On a temporary basis, they are ready to take so many civil engineering students. And on that basis, they will take you. What this man says is that today, if the student is prepared to work in any part of the globe, civil engineering and mechanical engineering and petrochemical engineering. There is uh, am, ample number of opportunities. You cannot do so many opportunities. But you should have basic fundamental things. Like one acre is equal to how many square meters? Roughly 4,000 square meters. One hectare is how many square meters? 100 meter by 100 meter. That is 2.5 acres. One square kilometer has how many acres? Around 250 acres. 256 acres. One kg force is 9.8 meter. Concrete specific weight is 2500 kg force per meter. Steel specific weight is 7500 kg force per meter. Steel specific gravity is 7.4. Concrete specific gravity is 2.4. For soil, if no data is given, you should take it as about 2.4 or 2.65. Things like this, water has a specific weight of 1000 kg per meter cube. Things like that, 24 by 7, night, 2 o'clock also you should. If you know it, the job is worse. If you do not know, and if you simply buy hard things, or if you use the micro Xerox before the examination, you are not going to do it. You need not remember difficult, but you should have basic, strong, fundamental knowledge if you have. You have so many opportunities. Now, this man tells recently uh, that in the Amaravati also, if you can step, don't bother about salary, join, join the company. Have some basic fundamentals. Immediately after this, you will have some free time. In this free time, work with some organization. First of all, night, one student, he tells him, Say, saying that, uh, how are you, sir, something good. Then he said, what are you doing now? So I am working in a company, civil engineering company. Oh, very nice, which company? He says, it is changing of railway platform. Where is it located? Uh, it is located about a distance of about 40 kilometers from Ahmedabad in Google. So, how much you are getting salary? He said, uh, when did you pass? Sir, I passed out from going to Pagnada uh, one year before, last year. It is nearly one year now. So, what is it? How much shall we work getting there? Then he said, sir, it is a package of about uh, five lakhs. How did you get to that? I am not praising myself. He said, sir, uh, you only gave the number of shall working in uh, New Delhi. He said, he is my classmate in NIT school of civil engineering. 
and uh, who can be of some help to you, who is a very big person in Rome, who can help you. So I called him up. So he gave me a job uh, for a salary of 8,000 rupees per month. He gave. After two months, when I prayed, he gave me, he had put me in some job. And uh, I worked there eight, eight, with a salary of 8,000 per month in New Delhi. I worked there for nearly six months. Then suddenly your friend again called me. That you are doing very work, you are quite good. And uh, will you go to another job in uh, Ambaba? Same, uh, I will put you. He said, okay. And I did not even ask for salary first. When I, I straight went to Ambaba and joined, and they have given me the salary, and I am very happy. What I want to tell you is, at a very a tender age, learn something. Learn to. Whatever job you are doing, suppose you are getting 8,000 rupees or 80,000 per month, put your best and do it. You have a glorious one. Am I clear? He is your senior. When he could do it, he will do it. His name. Huh? Anybody know? In Nepal. 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 Now what I want to say is that there are opportunities, there are opportunities. Be self-driven and be motivated. Why I am telling you is, develop friendship with such type of person. Looks at that too. When a person like this comes, talk to him, interact with him, take his email ID, say hi now and then. Have photograph with him. Your networker is your networker. Your network is your net worth. Is your net worth. Net worth means contacts. Your contacts with persons like this man is your net worth. Worth means value. If you develop contacts with such a of persons, getting job is very, very easy. They will put you somewhere. They will help you. But when such a person comes and out of 800 students, civil engineering students, when only punch had shown interest to talk to him or listen to him. What is the contact with King Rome is not built in a day. Next please. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. This is uh, the big problem I am talking about. Uh, it takes 30 minutes to solve this problem. That is why in the examination it is given as a 16 marks question. Earlier you have done a simple problem. This is a typical complicated pipe network. This is 200 meter cube per minute is entering this network here. This is A, B, C, A. This is one this network. The other network is C, A, T. E. This is another network. Don't get confused. Observe my words very carefully. It is a combination of two networks. You should not say it is A, B, C, A and A, C, D, A. That is 100% wrong. The moment you do like that, you will crumble. You cannot do this. You cannot solve the network. The line AC is common to both the loops. Because the pipe which is common to both the loops, you should be in the same direction. When you are telling, when I say AC means flow is taking place from A to Q. When I say flow QCA means discharge is from C to A. You should give for a same pipeline, the direction must be same. That is why, what are the two loops here? A, B, C, A. This one loop. C, A, B, C. This is the second. Is it clear? Nobody explains such type of things. You should understand and uh, write in your own language. So this is the question given. The lines are A, B, B, C, C, D, A, B, A, C. Diameter is this. Length is meter is this. Length is this. Length is this. 
This is correct. When you write the lines, how you should write the lines? A, B, B, C, C, A. You cannot write it as A, C. Where is the name? What are the values of R? Tell me, give the power of 5 from each one. Have you got it as 750? 1,480? 1,600. Once again, I am telling you, there is infinite possibility that mistakes can be made from my side also, somewhere. Possible mistakes may be made, or because it is done by a student, by a scholar, and then corrected by me, it is quite possible. The chances are less because my student will do it calculated and I do it with common sense. So there can be very small mistakes. There cannot be major mistakes, can never be there because I always use my common sense. How you should know? Because R value in the calculate, it is a elastic e to the power of 5. I will give a lot of importance to diameter. If diameter is more, R value must be very less. If that is there in your mind, you will not do mistake. For example, for one pipe, diameter is given as 100 centimeters. By talking what it is, B is 0.1 meter. It is a mistake. I can take it as 0.1 meter and do it. I will get some answer. I will find the resistance as very high. But my mind will tell that it is the largest diameter. So resistance should be very, very less. To me, it is not. That is how? Throughout common sense. Throughout common sense. Throughout common sense. How people can vote for TDP? I'm telling you, once you cross, come out of the not a single person bothers about what person does. No, very bothers about what person does. Why are you talking about this? 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 Once again, I'm telling you, I'm telling you to tell that this is a very important thing. The servant maid in my house is a BSC first class kid. She did her BSC and she got first class. And we pay her 1500 rupees per month. She does not have a student for the week. If you ask her, what is 39.5? She cannot tell. If you ask her, what is the approximate value of 9.75? She cannot even imagine it. I don't know what exactly. I will not give you any time. 9.75 means 9 it is very close to 10. 30.5 means slightly less than 10. Sorry, answer is 10 into 40, 400. Slightly less than 400. She cannot even imagine us. Today, getting a degree, that to a first class degree output is not a good thing. Anybody can do it. You should have basic minimum fundamental knowledge and the common sense. So I was talking to somebody and I said, why there is so much of happening? A kindly student, distinction student, going for a GRE examination. He does not know the meaning of the term Avani. I was surprised. What is Avani? Who? Shikha? So, a word which is a very common word for me, you do not know anything about that. Then why people will give you a job? Please write that word, as well. Okay. When I am talking, it is good that you are listening, but your hand should work. You should be as an engineer. You should be smart enough to work while working. 
जंगली में वर्किंग टू टीच सम बैकग्राउंड म्यूजिक सिमिलरली टीच माय वर्ड्स एंड बैकग्राउंड म्यूजिक इज इट ओके सो हाउ डू डू बट लाइन ए बी बी सी एंड सी ए हैव रिटन देन आर वाई यू हैव फाउंड इट इज इट करेक्ट ओके देन क्यू एज्यूम हाउ डू एज्यूम क्यू आर वाई यू बी सी इट इज वेरी हाई देन थाउजेंड
to assume the flow. Within brackets are given the values of R. R means resistance to flow, which is proportional to, which is equal to 8F L by pi square T D to the power of pi. Because it is a relative term, 8 energy can be neglected. Its value can be taken as 1. So resistance depends on L by D to the power of pi. That value of L by D to the power of 5 can be calculated if length and diameter are given. But in this particular case, the examiner is a good friend of us. He has calculated the value of L and L by D to the power of 5 and given the direct value as resistance within brackets as 4, 4, 21.2, 21 21.2, 21 and 8.5. So, next to the value of R, write the assumed flow. The assumption is in your hands. On what basis you have to assume? Only one condition. And that is, inflow is equal to outflow. Take for example, junction A. Inflow is 150 meter cube per day. Kunchum bike. A degree 150. At A, flow is 150 meter cube per day. Is inflow. Outflow is discharge from A to B plus discharge A to D plus discharge A to C. That must be equal to 150. So, if you do not know anything, you do not have any common sense, also, you should write it as simply 50, 50 and 50. But, in the line AB, the resistance is least in line A D, resistance is maximum. So, you should assume very high flow in A D, let us say 100. And uh, in 21.2, the flow should be least, say 10. And when in A C, you should not assume. You should follow the rule, inflow is equal to outflow. So, that is 100 plus 10, 110, remaining is 40. This you have to assume 41. That you cannot assume. And make the total 200. You will not solve it in your lifetime. Next to Janma also you cannot. Now come to, and similarly, you have to assume the other place. Now let us see. In a very systematic way, R value, if found out, draw the table. The line AC is common. It should have the same direction for both the loops. Find the values of R. Find the assumed flow. Depending on the direction, give it plus or minus. Next. The answer is like this. First sortable flows are assumed in each pipe. As RAB is 4, 4 flow of AD is assumed in line AB. Similarly, as R A D is 21.2, a relatively very small flow of 10 is assumed. Using inflow is equal to outflow, R A C is equal to 60. I have assumed like this, so I have done like this. Whatever you have assumed, you do like this. <laughs> now, see both the circuits. One circuit is A B C A. Second circuit is A D C A. Why have taken circuits like this? Because the line C A is common to both the circuits it is given the same direction. So what are the pipelines in the first circuit? A, B, B, C, C, A. Second circuit, A, D, D, C, C, A. What are the values of R? You have already they are given. So write them. R has no direction. Assumed Q is 80 in the first loop. A, B. For B, C, 30. For A, C, it is 60. For C, A, it is minus 60. That is, within brackets I have written Q. Later I have written HF. HF is equal to how much? R into Q square. 
8 fl q square by pi square g d to the power of 5. The other portion is r. So r into q square. So 25,600. Here it is 3600. For c i it is minus 3600. H of by q. H of by q means uh, r into q. Or H of value you know that divided by q. Whatever it is. Find sigma H of as minus 1400 and sigma h of by q as 16. This is minus 1400. Find delta q. What is delta q for the first circuit? Minus sigma h of by n sigma h of by q minus of sigma h of is minus 1400. So minus of minus 1400 divided by n is 2 into 6. Suppose you are using has an Williams formula. Take this value instead of 2, you write it as 1.8. You write it as 1.8, but it is minus. No problem. So this comes to 0 0.74. Similarly, for the second circuit, you find it as 16.38. So this is the value of delta Q. It is 0 0.74. Here it is 16.38. And then apply them. So here, what is the correction? 0 0.74. Delta Q. So what is the new Q? Is it 7.4? How much is it? Not delta. Delta ADCA, 16.38. This is 16.38. This is assumed flow is 10. So what is the new flow? Again, first iteration I have written it as 26.38. 10 plus 16.38, 26.38. Minus 10 plus 16.38, so 6.8. Minus 60 plus 16.38, minus 42.9. Right. Here, CA is the common line, so minus 60, you have to apply the combined correction. You will get it. So for the common line CA, this is the correction, 17.12. Not 16.8, plus 16.8, 17.1. Similarly, correction for line change in the second iteration is minus 8.8. Correction for line third. So once you know the uh, correction, you apply the. This is the this is the assumed flow. This is the corrected flow. You take this as the corrected flow and again apply delta IQ and again apply the corrected flow. Right. You have to do it. Yeah? The correction value becomes zero. So finally, as you see, originally the cor uh, correction is 16.38 here, first time. What is the value in second time? 2.37. Continuously decreases. You have to do three, four iterations, otherwise you cannot do it. That is why now it is computed. In final year, you have CAD. Where? Is it possible in a, in, a, in a town, in a city, how many such networks will be there? Thousands of networks will be there. And how many thousands of networks you will solve? If you have to solve a pipe network here, you have to find the uh, flow in this, in this particular line, you have to flow. In this line, how you have to do it? It depends on the network in the prior uh, to that. So like this, it becomes more and more complicated. So all this is solved very easily by that camp. That is why in the third year or final year, final year, first semester, I think you are having a lab, CAD lab, in which you can do all this can be programmed. If you give these instructions, how to calculate the correction factor, if you give the instructions, the computer will automatically find on its own and then it will give the correct uh, solution. But you should know on what basis you have to guide it. You have to tell. Unless you know it, you cannot write it. Is it clear now? Do it now. Any value you have is assumed. The advantage of it, even if you are very wrong, uh, ultimately you will get the correction as zero. Correction diminishes. Next. Then what is that? You will see some of the gate questions today. You write only the answers because this property is yours. Don't write the question. 
write only the answer. There are about uh, 15 questions. In 10 minutes, very hurriedly, you will do it. Obviously, some of the questions, if you know, you can answer. If you do not know, you cannot answer. And don't take chance, generally. So, what I say is, for each question, write the answer. And after the 15 questions, let us say how many marks you have got. For each question, carries one mark. Take two mark is, uh, my, uh, if you are wrong, you will, it will carry minus one mark. Treat it sincerely as a gate exam. And all these are gate questions only. If 2% solution of a severe sample is taken into the 300 ml BOD bottle and incubated for 5 days at 20 degrees centigrade, the depletion of oxygen was found to be 5 ppm BOD of the series B. What is BOD? Biochemical oxygen demand. It is oxygen demand. That is oxygen required. So, in 5 days, the oxygen value decreased by 5 ppm in the bottle. And how that is prepared? It is a 2% solution is prepared. That means 2 ml of the sewage is mixed with 100 ml of the distilled water, pure water. And for that, this is found like If original sample is taken, what is the dissolved oxygen would change would be? That is DO. DO is DO, DO1 minus DO2. DO1 minus DO2 is how much? 5 ppm. But, so, if it is a river water, it would have been 5 ppm only. But sewage, what we do is, instead of directly doing it, we take only 2 ml of the sewage sample, and then in 100 ml, we dilute it. And we multiply with the dilution factor. So, this is the term. Take a chance and write some of Not that we don't do, put a, for every question, if we say pass, 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 then this has no sense. For every question, you can answer. This is your own evaluation. Your conscience is your police. Nobody will correct you. Second question is of our syllabus variety. The non clog pump which permits a solid matter to pass out with the liquid sewage is, for example, from a reservoir, water is to be supplied to a city. Same question is asked. Water is to be supplied, dirty water is to be supplied to the water treatment facility. What treatment? Which pump is used? A. Centrifugal pump, reciprocating pump, sector, none of these. In this, uh, yeah. you should understand that instead of liquid sewage, all this is a problem also. Third question. Assertion A. Discharge the evidence for the oxidation ponds just upstream of lakes or reservoirs is under there. This is a statement. The discharged algae get settled in the reservoirs and cause androgen deposition in other water bodies. Another statement he has given. All these are gate questions. Now, A. Both A and R are true and R is the correct explanation of A. B. Both A and R are true but R is not correct explanation of A. C. A is true but R is false. B. A is false, but not. You have the answer. I am not giving the answer at the end. Because after 16 questions, when I tell the answer, you will not understand anything. I am giving the answer. First question P is dilution is equal to fraction of face water in the sample of 300 ml BOD, but it is 2 by 100. There is a 100 ml is made up uh, to 100 ml of the sample, it contains only 2 ml of the sewage. So it is 0 0.02. What BOD is oxygen consumed. What is the oxygen consumed? It is 5 mg per liter. But how much dilution is made? 5 divided by 2 by 100. So it comes to 5 into 100 by 2. So it comes to 250. Anybody got it? Good. This is called calculated risk. Sometimes you have to take a calculated risk, just like in T20 cricket match. Otherwise, the run rate will go to 15, 20, 30, 40 also. Some stairs you have to take a risk. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर टू इज सेंट्रिफिकल पंप क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री इज द करेक्ट आंसर बहुत ये आर आर टू आर इज द करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट वॉट इज दट स्टेटमेंट लेट इज सी वेरी हर वेन वॉट वेस्ट वॉट इज ट्रीटेड इन ऑक्सीजन एंड इफ इट इज लेफ्ट इन दीम ऑफ लेक और रिजर्वायर वॉट हैपन आल गे ऑक्सीडेशन पॉइंट इज ट्रीटेड बाई आल गे आल गे आर नोन एज फोटोट्रॉक्स वॉट इज मेट बाई फोटोट्रॉक्स फोटो मीन्स लाइट दे वॉन्ट सन लाइट सो फॉर वॉन्ट ऑफ सन दे विल कम टू दिसन सो दे विल पोल्यू टील ग्रो सो दैट वे दे शुड नॉट so it is not from your subject if you have not understood you need not worry about it but it is good to know something very slightly initial changes now okay next very quick please write the answers fourth question pick the pick up the correct statement from the following in treated sewage four ppm of do is essential don't think that it is connected with sewage sewage water waste water all are same For example, distilled water we are not supposed to drink. It is a waste water for us. Yes, sir. Waste water from the from our house can be used for uh, plantation. Is it a waste water then? So waste water depends on the condition we say that. Yes, sir. No. For the plant that is life, distilled water if you drink regularly you will die. It is a waste water, but it is poison. So, depending on the context, both are basically water only. That is all you have understood. Answer ten. Only very fresh sewage contains some dissolved oxygen. Solubility of oxygen in the sewage is 95 percent. That means distilled water. All the above. Five. For the survival of fish in a river stream, the minimum DO prescribed is dash 3 ppm, 4 ppm, 5 ppm, 10. The most dangerous pollutant in vehicular emission is CO, SO2, CO2, CO2, CO3. Seven. Such tanks are used for storage of uh, storage water to increase velocity in the pipeline as water flow up to guard against water damage. All these are covered by me. If you remember, I was not knowing all these things. Let me tell you, these questions are all completely made by Hamantri, who I introduced. These are all from gate question papers. I have given him old question papers. And I told him copy all questions from uh, related to environment engineering because in the time water and waste water both were in the same uh, subject into this. But I felt that is all I have covered. Okay. Next, these are the answers. Question number four, all the above. Question number five, answer is four ppm. I told several times that if dissolved oxygen in water pond is less than four ppm, fish cannot survive. For aquatic life, to, like fish, to so minimum four ppm concentration must be maintained in the uh, water ponds. And fish is an index of pollution. If dissolved oxygen is less than four ppm, fish die. It means that the water is contaminated. That water we should not drink. If the fish are in a good condition, healthy condition, it shows water is very good for drinking. You also can drink it for tea because fish are very sensitive. If they are surviving, means that if you are drinking, you are also drinking. The index of food. What is the number one source of food for the human being? Entire world. It is fish. Next question number six is CO. From fifth class onwards in the syllabus, this point is there that vehicular vehicles per unit vehicles generate uh, carbon monoxide. No need to suicide when there is carbon monoxide. So very very dangerous gas released mainly by automobiles only, not by industries. Released by automobiles. Automobiles released mainly CO and the second pollutant there is C. It C means hydrocarbon. And all uh, diesel or uh, petrol, these are all hydrocarbons only. Hydrocarbons are really natural because they cannot be burned completely due to incomplete combustion. Hydrocarbons will be released. So the main pollutant is CO and uh, hydrocarbons, and of course, and oil salts. 
But she was a very from sixth class onwards she has taught sixth class. That's why I am telling you whenever you visit seventh class, eighth class, ninth class children, these things you will be surprised. You may not be knowing, they know it. And you tell them that in final year engineering also we are learning that they are very very essential. That's a really common thing. And same question number seven. Hundred times I told that. Uh, what is the search tank? Suppose this is the pipeline. This is at the end. I have kept a sluice valve or gate valve. If the gate valve is suddenly closed, what happens? The velocity of the flow is completely closed. Throttle head must remain constant. So velocity head will be converted to pressure head. So pressure inside the pipeline increases. But the pipe is designed for a particular pressure only. So the pipe will be burst. It will be broken into pieces. So to prevent the pipeline, what we do? We keep a pressure relief valve. So instead of pressure relief valve, if you make a small hole and connect a tank like this, then all this water under high pressure it goes to that tank. So pressure such a tank in a hydropower plant is hundred percent similar to synonym to synonymous to pressure relief valve in a pipeline, which is always placed close to the gate valve, upstream side of the gate. All this explanation I have done to you. I am sure that with question number seven, everybody is correct. How many of you are correct? Question number seven. Next question. Okay. As per IS 772-1963, water required per head per day for average domestic purposes is 65 liter, 85 liter, 105 liter, and 130. What is your answer? 135 liter. But that is not the answer you are. That is not the thing you are supposed to learn from this question. But the question you have to learn, and that is, the highest code is seven seventy nine. What is the uh, highest code which gives the quality? Which code gives? Sorry, raise your hand. Only two. Without that, can there be an exam? It is highest ten thousand five hundred ninety one twelve. Please write it this time. Highest ten five hundred. Highest one zero five zero zero. Dash twenty twelve. This is the highest code. Which use drinking water standard. Okay. Next question. In slow sand filters, the turbidity of raw water can be removed only up to. Okay. Have, have you written the answer? Yes, Write the answer before you speak out yes, the answer. Yes, Otherwise, you will not. Uh, you not write yes, yes, But you should give a scope to learn from your mistake. Yes, what do you say? Wrap yes, sand filters are meant for the removal of that yes, yes, They remove that. Yes, yes, Slow yes, sand filters yes, are meant for yes, the removal of. Yes, they are meant only for the removal of bacteria. So, for the pre-treatment required for rapid sand filter is that it must be coagulated because removal is by absorption. In slow sand beds, they are meant for the removal of bacteria. So, turbidity must be. Turbidity is more than 60 mg per liter. We have to remove the turbidity from the sand. Because it is mainly meant for the removal of bacteria. So the answer is 60 mg. So if it is highly turbid, then bacteria will. Turbidity acts like a shield. They will protect the bacteria. We have to remove the turbidity. They are not meant for the removal of bacteria. They are meant for the removal of bacteria. They can remove effectively only if turbidity is there. Biochemical oxygen demand of safe drinking water must be. Acidity in water is causes you to A. Mineral acids B. Three CO2 C. Ferrous sulfate B. Aluminium sulfate B. All these Next please these are the answers. Question number eight: It is 135 liters per capita per day, but there the code is for 135 liters per day. Oh, yes, they can. 
he will go through. We will see that the same question is repeating or not. Such type of things a person will be doing. He is known as moderate. That way such questions they never will be. But chances are coming. That is called smart. So if such type of questions, if you have a very clarity, then what happens is that it may be given by a geology candidate. That question may be given by an environmental engineering student, the faculty. That question may be also given by a water resources person. Yes or no? That is why these questions are very easy. What is the answer for this? This is called smartness. If you are preparing for three hours for an examination, take it for granted. 30 minutes you should spend, you should spend in sharpening the axe. If you are preparing so many minutes for gate examination, several hours, sometimes several minutes, you should spend a lot of time in observing the question paper from which portion is very important and critical. What should be avoided intelligently? What topic I should concentrate on? For example, fluid mechanics, pipes and series and pipes and balance topic is there. Fluid mechanics it may be there. In uh, what, uh, water supply engineering field. Severs and uh, partially running uh, severs is there. That may be asked in water resource engineering. That may be asked in hydraulic engineering. That may be asked in fluid mechanics. That may be asked in water supply engineering. It will be the main parameter which you need to study to what you Five subjects that topic. With the microbiome, your blue baby disease is caused with tissue dash. 3 ml of raw sewage is diluted to 300 ml. Same question. Every time you will get 1% regarding this. Very simple. You need not study. How much? I have already explained. So, what is your answer for the first question? Next question. 17, 18 also are given. The arrangement made for passing the sewer line below an obstruction below the hydraulic gradient line is called A, inverted siphon, B, depressed receiver, C, act pipe, D, all the other. 17 government is under the total 18. Something is coming in the 8 government, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4, 
answer should always be driven by purified the economy. Many people, they do not bother. If they get it as 0 0.003 ampere liter also, they mean it. And again, we use common sense, use common sense. See, as you know that it is around 200 to 300 people that will be very high. So in the question, it is given like this. So if you get it as 3 by 100 or 300 by 3, then you should know. Yeah, that is why gate questions are very, very easy, very easy, unless you have a gate of Question number 17, gate of Question number 17, gate of Okay. In a pipe flow, V is equal to 0.85 to CH, it to the power of D by 4 to the power of 0.63, R to the power of 0.63, R is hydraulic rate. Into S, S to the power of 0.4. S is H of by L, slope of hydraulic rate. So, what happens to uh, H of is proportional to how much? V to the power of 1 by 0.54. So, it, it comes to 1.8. Velocity is proportional, discharge is proportional to V, V to the power of 1. So, this is uh, to the power of 1. V is equal to Surya, C, V is equal to C root RS is Sagis for is equal to 1 by n into r to the power of 2 by 3 s to the power of half is Manning's formula. HF is equal to ml v square by 2 gd is Darcy Westbeck equation. In all these cases, HF is proportional to q square, whereas in case of Hazen Poisson, it is proportional to 1.8. Finished. So fast. So with this, the 99 percent of the syllabus of subject of environment uh, is finished. I could complete in a very less time because uh, of book, because of uh, whenever you have to draw a picture, it takes a lot of time. Whenever you have to solve a problem, for example, in a single class, you can solve only one or three class method problem. It takes nearly one hour, more than one, because it needs some explanation also. But because everything is done here, all calculations are done, uh, I, within a short period of 15 minutes or so, I could complete one hard class correction. I would have solved two problems. And in the previous class, I have solved one. So, because of this, advantage. similarly, if the gate wall is there or non return wall is there, if I have to draw a picture on the blackboard, it takes almost uh, 15 to 20 minutes. In a single class, you can cover maximum half of the appurtenances are one appurtenances at the most you can cover this. You have to draw it. But you will, you will see that the, class, the entire uh, topic of what appurtenances was completed in a single class. In addition to that, we have solved so many other gate problems. So that is the advantage we will completely cover the syllabus. Now it is in your hand. Once again, uh, I invite uh, goal number. 7 and 8 also, maybe whatever, come very hurriedly and uh, you can come along with your book also, don't write, don't write. But be brief and tell uh, point blank points which you have learned today. Will start with this. Thank you. And uh, the minimum EVA of uh, the river for survival of fishes for, for most dangerous CO today we have a birthday boy tiger and happy birthday to tiger
The landings of our today's class is we have an intermediate water supply system is provided for a city. The, uh, the water system should contain uh, residual chlorine and the water supply to the people. The centrifugal pump is a pump, non clock pump, which permits. Prevent transport from water hammer. Such tanks are provided. And the biological BOD present in drinking water causes diarrhea and retention. Any other member also? Any one person? As well as the bus driver. Say something very quick. Such tanks which are used to prevent the water hammering and learn about the theoretical range of dissolved oxygen. It is 0 to 14.5 mg per liter and blue baby, this is responsible due to night trades but not night rides. Uh, in slows and uh, the turbidity removed is uh, 60 mg per liter. Thank you. Yeah, my name is Saikir. wants to say something, share something, sing. Thank you then. Thank you very much and once again I extend a hearty welcome and an invitation to every one of you that anybody who is interested in to be a part of this MOOC program, to be a teacher along with me the next class you are welcome. We send your PPT in advance. everyone in the entire set. The next uh, Friday is the last and final chance for every one of you to communicate with one another. People from any part of these eight districts, if you are interested, you send your PPK and call me. My phone number, you all are aware, 9849136135. My email ID, you all know that, kvsg.muralikrishna at gmail.com. Once again, I am repeating, it is kvsg.muralikrishna at gmail.com and my phone number is EDSEFS which comes to which can be decoded as 9849136135 you two minutes to four minutes it should be it can be on any topic uh, directly or indirectly related to water supply engineering or environmental 
and uh, if you provide that in the next class i will be giving the revision revision of the entire syllabus i will be giving at the appropriate place i will give you a chance to present the, uh, you also can present your uh, ppt there so you will become uh, so next class will be handled by two persons one is you second one is i you and i can do hi let's do valle thank you very much